My name is Brittany Thurman. I am the Studio Programs Manager at the Speed Art Museum. And today, I am going to show you how you can use cereal boxes in your own home to create art. So this art activity is called Package Portraits. It is inspired by the art of Andy Warhol. Andy Warhol is also known for his pop art art, um, his art that utilizes things that you might find in your own cabinet, such as a can of soup. So today we're going to create our own pop art inspired by what's in our pantry. So if you have um, a box of cereal lying around, you can cut that up to create your art. Um, you will need scissors, glue, uh, a piece of scrap paper. This can be blank paper or colorful paper, whatever you have lying around. You will also need a portrait um, of yourself. This can be a picture that you have printed off of your computer, or if you don't have a printer or a computer, what I've done is I have found images in magazines and I have cut those out instead. So for our example, I have my first package portrait. Um, so I have a face, I've created a necklace out of cereal boxes and some glasses, possibly 3D glasses, for um, this piece of art. So let's make one together. So you will need your piece of scrap paper, your glue stick. I am going to glue down my image and place this onto my paper like so. Okay, so we're not done here. Um, so now I need to add my design. So I have cut out several different objects or shapes for my piece of cereal, uh, my cereal box. So I have circles that I am going to use for earrings. I have a little hat that I have created to put on her head. And she has a pretty bright smile, but we need more smiles around here. So I have a smile. And what else can I do? Hmm, maybe some eyebrows. Okay. Okay, so now I am going to glue all of my objects down. Earring earring, hat, eyebrow, maybe she needs two. Okay, we're going to do two eyebrows. And her smile. All right, so this is my package portrait. And you can create your own. So when you create your own, please be sure to tag, um, use the hashtag ArtSparksFromHome and we would love to see what you have made.